Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to scan documents directly to the cloud with Microsoft Office Lens. Now, Microsoft's been making a big push to support other operating systems lately. They have an Android launcher in the works and a deal with an Android manufacturer to dual boot Windows 10 on one of their phones. Just this week, they finally released their awesome document scanning tool for iOS and Android. Office Lens will not only scan documents, but it will also upload them to your OneDrive or your Office 365 account. It's really cool actually. The first time I tried this with my Android device, the document that I scanned immediately showed up on my Windows computer. Now to get this one going on your iPhone, all you need to do is install Office Lens from the iTunes App Store. For Android devices, the app is still in its beta testing phases. But signing up to be a tester is really easy. Just head to the Google Plus Office Lens community, which I have linked out at the full tutorial on Gadget Hacks. From here, tap the Join button to become a member of their community. After that, you'll be taken to the community's landing page. From here, tap the Become a Tester link in the first post. On this next screen, tap Become a Tester again. Then you'll get a message saying that you are now a tester. To install the app, click the link that says Download it from the Play Store. After that, you can just install the app like any other. Now with the app installed, the experience will be about the same on Android, iOS, or Windows phones. First up, you'll need to accept the license agreement. Then on this next page, tap Start Using Office Lens. From here, it's pretty simple. Just line up the viewfinder with the document that you're trying to scan. It doesn't even have to be a perfect head-on angle. Office Lens will recognize the document and line everything up for you. When it looks good, go ahead and tap the shutter button. From here, you'll get a chance to review the scan result and you can crop the document if you'd like. But when it's all set up, tap the save icon at the bottom of the screen. Then from here, you'll have to sign in with your Microsoft account if you haven't done so already. Once you've signed in, you'll get a chance to name the document and you can also choose what Microsoft services you'd like to save it in. There's OneNote, OneDrive, Word, PowerPoint, and a few others. And all these services are cloud-based now. So when you save to one of them, it'll immediately show up on your other devices. When you're ready, tap the check icon at the top of the screen and your document will be saved to the cloud. So it's a very capable camera scanner and the cross compatibility makes it one of the best options on the market. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.